Hi, let's take a look on how to do this brush on text effect in HitFilm. For this, you will need a colour brush stroke PNG and any background you wish to use. First off, we will start with a 10 second composite shot and then add the background and the brush stroke PNG to the composite. Position the green brush stroke layer where you want it to be and then set the scale. Then go to new layer and then add your preferred text. And resize and set your text position. Go to effects, then add a set matte effect to the green brush stroke layer. Set source layer to new text and blend mode to subtract. Turn off visibility to new text and pair new text to green brush stroke. Now make any final adjustments to your text size and position. Add a white plane layer and name it left underline. Reduce the scale until it fits under the left side of your text. Then duplicate the layer and name it right underline. Then adjust until it fits under the right side of your text. Look for the set matte effect again and add to the green brush stroke layer. Set source layer to left underline and blend to subtract. Do the same to the right underlined layer. Go into effects, colour gradient and drop a three strip colour effect onto the green brush stroke layer. Then open it up and set it to a strong green to give the brush stroke a wet paint look. Then keyframe the effect to fade out to zero as if the paint is dry in. Next, you need to set a mask around your brush stroke effect. Make the mask bigger than the brush stroke. Then keyframe the position of the mask to reveal the brush stroke effect. Make adjustments with the keyframe until it feels right. Pay left underline and right underline to the new text layer. Go to effects and look for the blood spray effect and add it to the green brush stroke layer. Then open up the blood spray effect panel as the start points need to be adjusted. Under position, change the blood spray start point to the beginning of the reveal of the brush stroke. Under particle generation, I'm going to change the start time to 0.11 to make the effect start at the same time, otherwise it will start too soon. I'm also going to up the amount of particles. Under particle birth properties, I'm changing the spread to 37. I'm moving the direction slightly to 81. Next, I'm changing orientation to 64 and check your position is right for you. Then onto the appearance to change the colour. I'm picking the darkest greens and the lightest greens so the colour matches the brush stroke. I'm also going to adjust opacity so it fades away. I'm going to change everything except the background to a 3D plane. And under new camera, I will keyframe the camera to give it a float away effect. Lastly, I will add some background sound and a brush stroke sound to finish it off. If you enjoyed this video, then please subscribe and hit the like button. And thanks for watching.